Turn out of sports, Clemson starts regional play in just over half an hour. The Tigers with home field advantage. And our sports team is there tonight. Right now we want to go out live to sports director Beth Hool, who's in Tigertown with more. Beth? Yeah, it's a beautiful day for some baseball. You couldn't ask for a better situation, and I personally love the lack of humidity uh, as I still acclimate to the south here. Uh, looking forward to this home field advantage for Clemson baseball, especially because, as Eric Backich has told us all week long, that home crowd can really make a difference for a team. He pointed out they experienced that a couple weeks ago against Wake Forest, and he would love to see the Clemson fans be able to do that. More than anything, he remembers what DKS has been like in its pass when this place is packed and the fans are working together in unison to really create a hostile environment. He has memories of that not only from when he was here as a uh, coach back in the day when he was first starting his career, but also coming back here in that other dugout coaching with Maryland. He remembers how wild this went and he shared some of those memories with us this week ahead of this regional. Yeah, DKS was regarded as one of the most hostile places to play. And um, in 02, when I was here the first time, it was like that. And then coming back as the coach in the other dugout when I was at Maryland, I mean, it was awful to play here. I mean, I remember uh, frickin' Brad Miller won a tractor because he hit a triple. It was a fifth inning. You hit it, if Clemson hits a triple, some fan gets a tractor. And Brad Miller, sure enough, hits a triple. And the place was going nuts. And I couldn't, you know, our guys couldn't even hear each other think. And, and there's nothing better than that sort of environment to be playing postseason baseball in. Clemson would love to be able to get that crowd behind them and ride this in uh, to the next couple of weeks of baseball here in Clemson. It starts with High Point. Eric Backich, notorious for talking about his regionals as the name of that first opponent. This is the High Point Regional, and that is where their focus has been. If the fans need any enticing to come out to this one, I can tell you this. This Clemson baseball team can never be ruled out. They are the comeback kids this year. I asked Coach Backage uh, if that's how they plan to play this one and what it's like to have that sort of confidence in this team that they are never out of a game. He said that is this team's superpower and they will ride that to the very end. The road to Omaha begins tonight for Clemson baseball. The first pitch in just over a half an hour here in Clemson. Looking forward to this one for now reporting live with the Tigers for Fox Carolina Sports. I'm Beth Wool.